episode of Sugar Drop and Snacks. And today we are going to go ahead and rate some of the chocolate that we uh, got when we went to Bedre. You're right, Bedre. Bedre Chocolate Factory. So it's a Native American owned chocolate factory in uh, central Oklahoma. And what does Bedre mean, baby? Uh, it means better in Norwegian. Yeah, that's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. All right, let's get into it. Okay, so let's go ahead and start with the chocolate gummy worms. Okay, that's definitely different. Okay, so if I'm looking at this based on appearance, I wouldn't know what I would, some chocolate covered candy or something. So I would say appearance is a two, but I don't know that you can, I don't know how you could make this a five. What do you think? No, I'm I'm trying to be open-minded about it. You know, all in fairness, I was trying to get out of my comfort zone and say, like, let's try something different. But um, I'm really at a one on appearance. I'm going to just be honest about it. Okay, what's next, babe? Taste. So we're going to taste this. Okay. So this is a gummy worm, a chocolate gummy worm. Mm, okay, I see. Here's the worm part. <laughs> There's the gummy part. There's the gummy part. <laughs> this is actually pretty good. Mine is cherry. What is yours? Yeah, mine. I got the cherry. So this... I think they kind of kept with a theme of chocolates and cherries. Yes. So I think for the taste on this, I would actually give this a four. I like this. Okay, I'm surprised. I am too. I, I'm surprised. I was trying to go out of my comfort zone. But I did not expect this. I think that they really thought this out because I was afraid. I was afraid I was going to be like, oh, God, I'm not going to like this, but I'm going to try yes. it. But it's cherry. It's now, cherry. Now, that one's different, isn't it? Isn't yes. That one different? It's, it's just the gummy worms that they're using. Yeah, but isn't that different? Mm-hmm. That is, is really cherry. good. It's, okay. It's okay. a lighter... Flavor, mm -hmm. but I I really would give this a four. I really like this. I could eat more a lot more than just one. I am surprised. I'm going to admit this. I thought I was going to hate this, but I'm with you. This is actually good. <laughs> this is a four. <laughs> yes. I'm at a four. What about the smell? Let's see. I don't really smell anything. So for the smell, yeah, I'm a one. I'm a one with the smell. I'm a one. Texture. The texture. I think the texture. It's a gummy worm. It's a gummy worm covered and chocolate. covered in chocolate. So I'm going to say the texture is a three. Yeah. Yeah, I'm at three. The chocolate is good with it, though. It, it really is. is. It is really good. I'm trying to show the camera and not take it all, but I was surprised. Yeah. This is actually pretty good. So the texture is a three. Mojo, baby. The mojo, I would say this is a four. Only because I remember the gummy worms when I was a kid. And I used to love to eat them. So I guess because it's, for me, it kind of feels like going back to my childhood. So mm -hmm. for the mojo, I'm going to say it's a four. And also because the chocolate just takes it up a level. Yeah. I tell you, I'm surprised that I like it. Uh, the mojo for me, I'm going to give it a 3.5. I'm going to kind of split it. A 3.5. It's good. I was surprised that I was going to like this. This. Okay. What yeah. do we got next, baby? Next, we have the white chocolate bark. Um, I got this for the appearance. I really like the appearance of this. Um, and I also love white chocolate. So it has uh, nuts in there. They look like almonds. Um, I think that's a pecan, baby. Or perhaps. See how long it is in and... the shape? I think that's a pecan. We'll know when we taste it. We'll know it. when we taste it. So for appearance, I like this. It get, For the appearance, I give it a four. Appearance, I think it's really neat. I'm not really a white chocolate fan, but this is pretty. I mean, it's kind of hard not to say it's not pretty. Exactly. So I'm, I'm, I'm going to give this a four for appearance. And let's see, for taste. Okay. It is a pecan. Mm-hmm. This is really good. 
Oh, wow. <laughs> this white chocolate mm -hmm. is very good. It's very sweet. What did you give it? I would give it a five for a, the taste. I'm a four. This is solid. They did a really great job. But again, I love white chocolate. So and I'm not a really a white chocolate fan, but this is actually good. I'm this is really good. I'm a four on the taste. Because you get the nuttiness, obviously, from the pecan. Yeah. And yeah. you can tell it's a high quality ingredient, too. Yes. Smell? Smell? I'm going to say a one because I don't really smell anything. For no. The... No. I'm, I think I'm at a one, too. Mm-hmm. But you, the taste is carries it. It carries it, but it's not really that much to smell. Texture, you good? Texture, I would say give it a four. And then the mojo, I'm sorry, the texture, what did you decide on the texture? Yeah, you don't want my texture, baby? No, <laughs> of course I do. <laughs> yeah, my texture, this is better. I think this is a four for texture. Okay. And then for mojo, for me, this is really good. Mm -hmm. um, it doesn't. I would say the mojo for me is a three, but I love the taste. I do love the taste of it, but the mojo is still a three for me. Yeah. This is a good solid three. You should try this. So while we were at Bedre's, we went ahead and stopped at the Chickasha, um, visitor center yeah. and they have a they have a, a store that you can buy native american products and so this is you know works they were blankets purses mugs magnets and they were all made by native american people and this particular mug that i got it's called the rodeo sisters and apparently it's a collector's item but unfortunately, I think I will probably use it. <laughs> so, and I also went ahead and bought the magnet. Uh, you know, the lady is uh, from Oklahoma. She does make them and they're very fragile. So um, I really love the items that they had at the gift shop. And I would definitely recommend stopping by and picking up some items and supporting uh, Native American people. So until next time. All right, please join us again. And bring the... Da -da.